I'm back. Hey everybody, it's XV. Yo. And good God! Oh, Chandlo, you look amazing, bro. Uh, so, hi everybody. We're back. Um, <clears throat> I have a bunch of stuff left undone. Hello. Uh, yes, yes. Hello, hello, Gramble. Um, go, go over there. Thank you. So, I still need to interview Cromdo. I have a bunch of quests that I need to start up. What's up? How you doing, Chandlo? Uh, I, I also, Philbo has something that uh, he wants to talk about with me. Before I do, there was one thing that I wanted to do. So uh, before I do any of the quest related things, I am going to clean up some things that I either saw or collected last time, but did not get around to doing. So I found this up here, this bag. Whoop. Oh dear. Uh -oh. Yep. Good start, good start, good start. So, um... <clears throat> I have... Uh, I did a little bit of stuff in the in-between. I picked up enough... Uh, I picked up and, and uh, rehomed, I guess, enough... Uh, enough uh, uh, bug snacks that I am now a proud owner, as you'll see. My... Uh, uh, it looks like I've got uh, an inventory space of 12, which uh, is going to make a bit of a difference, hopefully. How the hell am I going to do this? Oh, I know how to do this. I'm going to use a launch pad. All right. All right. Give me that back. Come here. All right, so... We've got Befica's thing back. You notice, by the way, the uh, those snack packs do not regenerate. Once we have them, they seem to be gone for good. Um, when I was looking around before, because uh, that that big four pack sandipede thing uh, is really really solid for uh, donating. They, um, you know, because it's, it's four at a time. I also got a lollip. Sando, Sando, Yes. Hey, Wambus. Yes. Okay. So, uh, before I go further, before I go further, I am going... That's Wambus and Triffany. Here is Lisbert and Egabel. So, we have a couple of things. First of all... Well, that's video, di num video diary number four. All right. Uh, Boyant, I believe you told me that you thought that there would be a second, like a, uh, a video diary, and that is, it's video diary number three, that there would be a video <laughs> diary in that, uh, in that chest, and you're absolutely hey there. correct. Hey there. Fuck off. Wiggle. Piece of shit. All right, so, video diary number three. Here we go. Yeah, 1,000. You scoping my form? Egg? Uh, eight. <laughs> uh, hey, Inga, bro. Good workout today. Let's hit the showers. No. This is pathetic. I won't break yet. Oh, that's hard boiled, Egg. Who lit a fire under you? I just need to get strong enough to catch my own bug snacks. No disrespect, but you've been hitting the snacks pretty hard already. Aw, not you too. Mm. No, no. I'm saying you aren't doing this for snacks alone. But I can't help you if you're not honest with me. I'm just so sick of feeling like an empty shell. I want to stop relying on everybody else. I want to keep up with Liz for once in my life. Respect. I know things are tough with Liz right now. But dog, she loves you. She'll be back to normal in no time. Chandler was such but a good person. I don't want to go back to normal. I don't want her worrying about me anymore. <laughs> when you love somebody, you never stop worrying about them. I know. And I'm worried about her, too. I just want to take better care of her. And that starts with me. Yeah, I get that. And I will get you there. Thanks, Chandler. And, uh... Maybe I'll hit the showers after all. I smell rotten. Get it? Egg jokes. Okay, that's... This is, uh... 
This is shockingly real for a fruit-based body horror game featuring fucked up Muppets. Video diary number four. This is one that we found uh, up in up in the mountains nearby a fucked up thing that went right into the ground. Okay, let her fly and I'll show you my incredible aim. Just try not to hit Philbo again. When you're finished with your amusements, come see me. We have work to do. Get Lufty. out of here, Floofy. You're ruining my shot. What's wrong? There's something wrong about that grumpus. I agree. Floofy's not so bad. They're just passionate about science. Sure, science. I heard about their experiments, messing with your body. It's weird. Oh. What's weird about it? I mean, look at you. How many bug snacks have you had? Hey, in my professional medical opinion, I am perfectly healthy. Oh dear. We're all eating bug snacks, and we're all fine, so why are you getting on my case? I'm just worried, Bill. You're not acting like yourself. You mean I'm not miserable. I found a way to make myself useful and happy to finally take some control over my life. You're just upset because it doesn't involve you! Oh dear. I'm not upset. If you don't need me anymore, that's great. Go be with Floofty. Maybe I will! Jesus Christ. Oh. Okay. So, Floofty is clearly, clearly very, uh. Ooh. Hmm. Did not notice this before. Floofty, Floofty is very, very clearly, uh. Pretty in, in integral to whatever the f integral. I don't know. She's at. She's involved with whatever the fuck is going on. By the way, I just want to point out, um, <clears throat> Philbo, that fucking squeeb, He put me up in a bunch of sticks, and it took Chandlo to actually turn it into a goddamn house. <sighs> You're so good, Chandlo. We don't deserve you. No one does. All right. Oh yeah. Oh my god, thanks for finding my dice bag. I was playing games in the cave by myself when a frider tried to climb in the window. I panicked and threw my bag at it. And missed. Lol. Uh, oh, I got a fuzzy heart rug. Whoa. Bro, do you think you're up for the Chandlo dunk bun challenge? Go to the hoop outside of the mill and make two baskets without letting the ball hit the ground. I know you can do it, dog. Okay, so all of these requests are very clearly... Uh, these, these requests are very clearly all about... Um, uh, uh, yeah, just getting the fra. Hmm. It's just all about getting, uh, uh, what is words? I can't even think. Hanging lights! It's, uh, um, cosmetics. That's the word. I'm gonna avoid you, because I don't like you. There's Wiggle. Now, I have a couple of people to talk to before I let Philbo get us into yet another... Hey there, Cromdo. What are you How's it going? Hey, you pal. How you doing, Cromdo? The fuck is he doing? What is happening? Okay, so that's the second time, third time if we count Philbo, that someone has rushed yeah. to the bathroom. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna feed you one of these here crispy snack pots, because I've got two of them. I want to see what this does. Uh... You want... crisps for teeth? There you go. Ah! <laughs> I regret everything. Do you have time for an interview? Alright, I could use some practice. They'll be interviewing me every day when I'm a gazillionaire. <laughs> You're in the right place to be a gazillionaire. Let's start that interview. So, who are you? Business King, Sales Savant, future CEO of Starbucks, the one, the only, Cromdo Face! His name is Cromdo Face. Why come to Snack Tooth Island? You ever smell the future, kid? Huh? I can tell you, Lisbert stank of opportunity. She came on TV talking big about this new superfood, and I wanted in. So I quit my dead-end job and followed that stench of possibility. What do you suppose he... Oh, there we go. What was your dead-end job? Ah, I used to go door-to-door -door selling gruel to grandmas. Huh. Paid on commission, for grump's sake. 
Thoughts on bug snacks? <laughs> what do I think of? Delicious, irresistible, marketable. They're gonna catapult me straight to the top of Money Town, baby. Your teeth are made of potato chips. Why did you leave town? Yeah, I tried to make use of what Lisbeth didn't need anymore, and Befica didn't like that. Mm. Yeah, she went and told everyone that I'm a thief. I see. Weren't you stealing? I was salvaging! That's a community service, pal! But Befica planted evidence in my hut, said I stole her diary, so I did what any honest grump would do. I ran. Ah. <laughs> any info on Lisbeth? Oh, don't get me started. Everyone here thinks she's so great, such a fantastic leader. But I know the truth. She came here to stroke her ego and get Egabel her fix. The rest of us were just pss, disposable. Disposable? That's pretty cold. That's Elizabeth Megafic. When push came to shove, she abandoned us. What do you mean? I, I gotta confess, I was thinking about sailing <coughs> home after things got hairy. But when I went looking for our boat, it was gone. There's only two grumps missing. You do the math. Mm. <laughs> I bet Liz and Egg are living large in New Grump City by now. Calm down, Cromdo. That's enough for now. Yeah, 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 yeah. I get it, pal. I'm not the nicest grumpus around. I learned early on that life is like a box of trash. You always know what you're gonna get. <laughs> Trash. <laughs> Just go check out where the boat was. See what you think of Lisbeth after that. All right. I got a map to the boat. All right, so that's uh, the second map that I have picked up. Uh, Snath Tooth Island. All right, hold on. So, we've opened up a doorway from Scorch Gorge into whatever is just beyond Scorch Gorge, which could be literally fucking anything. Uh, hang on. It talks. Cromdo does crime. Cromdo would like to talk to me about something. I need to find a white chi poof. I need to feed a crispy snack pod to I don't know who. And, uh, yeah. Alright, so where am I? Hold on a moment. Oh, I see. These are my, uh, okay, so this is where I can keep track of my, uh, my, my requests. I can do most of these in the, uh, in between. That's not gonna be a problem. So this is what I have in my pockets, and these are my clues. So, I have a mystery map. Pressure plates won't activate. Where is this? Near the mountain peak, hang left from the, from the trail, take a narrow ledge north. Oh my god. Take the narrow ledge north, sea attached map, Snorpy. And Boiling Bay map. The end of Boiling Bay, past the shipwreck. Liz was definitely over there. You'll see. I think this, honestly, this is this this uh, uh, that X marking the spot. That's where I picked up uh, the this video diary number four. So I've already uh, already paid that off. And now we got to get to uh, this bit near the mountain trail, near the mountain peak, and left from the trail. Take a narrow ledge north. Sea attached map. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure that I've got that. Uh, okay. All right. Well, Cromdo wants to talk to me about something, so let's talk to Cromdo. Hey, hey Cromdo. You look like you're scheming. Psst. Hey, pal. I got a business opportunity for you. I got a tip that Trifony found some sort of treasure map while she was digging around. They say it'll lead to a huge bug snack. Imagine what a snack that size is worth. I was thinking of taking that map off her paws. That's where you come in. Get me a bug snack so delicious that Trifony would die for it, and we'll trade. Then we'll split the profits 50-50. <laughs> Did you say 15? I clearly said 50. <laughs> a buffalo cust? Buffalo cust. Okay, well, he wants us to do another party thing. So let me grab Befica real quick. Assuming she's anywhere around here. Where are you, Bef? Alright, well, hang on a second. Let's see. Full on ketchup. Not full on chocolate. All right. Evening. Full on hot sauce. Filling up on peanut butter. 
clearly not okay on ranch dressing. And hey, oh, look at that. It looks like nothing is growing. Good. It's just crap stuck in the ground. Life. Uh, there's Bramble. Where the fuck oh, is... hello! I thought I saw a hint of purple. Nope, it was just a flower. You know what? Fuck it. Hi, Wambus. Come here, buddy. How's it going? Uh, let's talk. We've almost got everybody. You're doing a great job, buddy. But hey, don't forget to take care of yourself. In fact, maybe you should turn in early today and just relax. Huh? Good idea. Oh, God. Huh. Something's wrong, buddy. We better take a look. Oh. Pefika, Gramble, what happened? Ooh, we saw something real spooky walk right into town. I thought it was a grumpus at first, but like something about it was wrong. Uh -oh. Was this creature wearing a crown by any chance? Or was it perhaps holding some sort of ceremonial dagger? What? No, no nothing like that. It looked kind of normal until it... <laughs> until it... It turned into a bunch of bug snacks and, like, scattered. That's what we saw. Frankly, we saw that. I find that hard to swallow. Nah, uh, what a load, Biff. Not enough drama around town for you lately, huh? Zonk off, Cromdo. Unlike you, I don't lie for a living. Oh, wow. So tell me then, what were you doing skulking around at midnight? Breaking into huts? Again? I seen it too. And this time I know it's not just one of my nightmares. Get some grump and sleep, Gramble. I can't! Not with all of y'all around here with your hungry mouths. Oh, God. Don't take this the wrong way, darling, but you are a bit high strung. A little beauty sleep would do you wonders. <laughs> Maybe then you'd finally let us eat a few pets. Jesus Christ. You say that again! Oh, oh, get off me. Oh. Oh. oh, hey, chill the grump out, bros. There's no need for all that. If what Gramble and Befica are saying is true, there's got to be some physical evidence left behind, yeah? Indeed. We should sweep the perimeter and keep watch in case the creature returns. Um, uh, good idea. Uh, buddy, do you think you can scope out the restroom? You know, find out what they saw? Sure. <laughs> I know he told us to go check out the, uh... Do I leave footprints? I do leave footprints. So these are definitely Grumpus footprints, and then now it's... And they turn into bug snack prints. Last clue I'm looking for. Whoa. Okay, that is definitely new. Okay. Hey, Felbo, how about we fucking leave? 
You found what you were looking for? All right, I'll call everybody together. Yes, I'm ready. Well, w w what did you find? There are tracks that aren't quite grumpus. Well, that's... Um, I reckon there's got to be some other explanation. Cram it, Wampo. We got a genuine monster on our paws. Hmm. Monster's a bit of a prejudicial term, don't you think? I'd call it more of a cryptid or undiscovered animal. It's no animal, darling. We're witnessing the queen of bug snacks in action. She's given us a warning! Oh, that is absurd. Which is more likely, that a so far unseen giant bug snack politely left a note on our door, or that this is some form of coordinated gaslighting by the Grumpenar- What's more likely, dear, is that you've watched far too many movies. Well, at least my theory has scientific data behind it, whereas you haven't even drawn one chart. I was top of the charts, thank you. Wiggle, turn oh, off! Whoa, 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 you know what? Let's split the difference, eh? You're both wrong. <laughs> uh, what does it even matter? Whatever it is, it wants us dead. Between this and the earthquakes, Snacksburg's becoming pretty unlivable. Mm -hmm. I hate to say it, bro, but I regret coming down from the mountain. Me and Snorpy were a lot safer before we came back. Same goes for me and my little ones. Oh, no, no, we shouldn't split up again. We're better off if we're all here together. That might have been true when Lisbert was around, but those days are long gone. Y you don't know that. She might come back. Yeah, <laughs> don't hold your breath, pal. Face it, Philbo. Without Lisbert, all we have is you. Uh, that's... that's... not true. Hello? Listen, I don't know why Lisbert put me in charge, but I do know this. None of you were really happy out there alone. We don't have Lisbert, but we have each other. Mm. Maybe if we try, we could all add up to one of her. Uh, I guess you're not wrong. So we're all staying in town then? Seems like it, as long as we can watch each other's backs. If we're gonna make it, we need everybody here. Floofty and Sheldar are still out there, and, and, and who knows if they're safe. If you must find Floofty, according to the tracking device I placed on them, they are the Boiling device. Bay. And the last time I saw Shelda, she was meditating in the sizzling sands. But don't forget about Egabel. If she's not with Lisbert, we gotta find her. We will, Chandlo. And once we do, we'll throw a big welcome back party. How does that sound? Please, no more parties. Oh, oh, okay. Great! Now, let's go get some sleep. You can sleep? Is it still carved in up there? Of course it is. No, it looks like we... Okay, it's gone. It's gone. So, no longer... No more bug snacks. Hi! Hi! Uh, I need to find Befica. Chandler wants me to do something. I'll grab him in a second. First, I want to grab Befica. Hello! Yeah, boy, things are getting spicy. Things, shit's happening. Where the fuck, why can I never find that? What's up, dog? How you doing, Chandlo? Still stumped? Yeah, bro. I'm not getting any stronger. I wasn't pushing hard enough. Maybe it's the bug snacks. We went way too small, you feel me? Oh, God. I've been hearing rumors about this monster snack out in the forest. Wamba said it was so huge, no Grumpus alive could lift it. Sounds like the ultimate workout. Let's catch it, bro! Uh, you know what? Let's do it. Aw, uh, yeah! Meet me in Flavor Falls. <laughs> this way, dog. Sure thing, Just dog. thinking about that buff snack is getting me pumped. Snorpy keeps telling me it's okay if I can't lift the tree stone. And I feel that. And I love him for it. But he just doesn't get it. Hey, Gulp! He'll crush you if you let it. He's gotta be strong enough to keep him safe from you. Did not know there was an up here. Whoa! 
What the fuck are you? Can I grab you? No? I guess that's not what we were going after. It's just a completely unrelated something burrowing around in the dirt. Oh, boy. Uh, it's... It's a watermelon. A mama melon. There it is! Wambus wasn't kidding. That snack is huge! All right, you big bug! Here comes the Chandlo Smell! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Alright, hold on. Loves. Okay. Okay, so here's the thing. Whoa, okay. I see. Those things. Alright. So, see that? I'm gonna have to use that to pull it down on her and crush her. You know, like you do. Right, what else do you have? So it hates... Absolutely feeding your babies to Muppets. I'm terribly sorry. It's just the way that this works. Distract the mama. You get the drop on her. Uh, I'm gonna have to bounce myself onto her, I guess. Uh, yeah, that sounds like what I'm gonna be doing. Okay, I got a mama melon. And all the babies are gone. Mama melon. I'm gonna feed Thanks, you. Thanks, bro. That bug could have killed me. It was way strong, dog. And once I eat it, I'll be just as strong. I don't think that's how this works, but you know, I I'll... 
Sure. Uh, you know what? Your head. Yeah. Yep. I was hoping I'd get twice as big or something. <laughs> no, I'm just the same Chandlo. And Chandlo isn't good enough. Chandlo is so good. I spent my whole life climbing a mountain. And once I got to the peak, all I saw was a taller mountain. Chandlo. Bro, even if I could rip out that stump, I couldn't stop an earthquake. There's always going to be something bigger than me. Oh my god. Stronger than me. Snorpy's always going to be in danger. He's a... Oh, they look like big, strong hands, don't they? Oh, Chandlo. Chandlo, it's okay, buddy. Buddy, can I... You're gonna be okay. You are the best person I've met. Possibly ever. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that all, 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 all of that did was give you a weird crest on your head, but... This world is strange. What's in here? Oh, you know what? I know where this is. This is where we, uh, uh this is from the beginning of the game. That's really sad. It's just, I mean, I want to do something for him. He's such a good person, and he cares so deeply about his... I don't know what the hell uh, Snorpy is to him. I don't know if they're lovers or just friends or really, really, really close friends. I, I, I'm not sure. It seems pretty clear that, that uh, Snorpy loves him, at least, and he loves Snorpy in whatever fucking way. Uh, I'm just saying, uh, maybe. Uh, your whole premise is flawed from the get-go. If bug snacks aren't like plants, then no amount of elbow grease is gonna make this work. Triffy, I thought you were here to support me. Oh, I am. It, it's just, um, you keep trying this over and over, and one of these days you gotta pack it in. <sighs> so I'm on my own. Well, if that's how you choose to look at it. Ugh. All right, what do you want me to do now, Wambus? Hold on a second. I'm gonna feed you some babies. There, have a, um... All right. We met. Yep, and your nose. <laughs> and it comes with a mustache! Perfect. All right, We're no more. Shaking, We're done. What Any luck so like? far? I'm sorry. I'm just about at the end of my rope. I'm done taking it slow. Just give me every sort of bug snack that digs underground. I reckon it might aerate the soil or something. Will that really work? Oh, I must look mighty foolish sticking to my guns like this. Oh, you look mighty but foolish. But you don't give up just because things get tough. If nobody else believes in me, I gotta believe in myself. It's that or... or nothing. Okay, we need oh, a snackery. Oh an Inchirito and a Sherby. We know that the snackery is in- you How know you what? doing? Uh, I'm doing just fine. All right, that's something we'll deal with a little bit later. Uh, deal or no deal, catch a buffalo cust, and Snorpy wants to talk, talk to me about something. Snorpy lives up in the mill house. That's where Floofty lives. Hello, Snorpy. Where's the stump, Snorpy? I removed it with my digging device. It took five minutes. Snorpy! Oh! <sighs> Thanks. Oh. Anytime, Chandlo. Oh. All right. Okay. That was lovely. Get up, Befica. Tell me who the fuck hey. wants this. What did you want again? Have you found any snack? They're the best snack ever because they don't even move. Okay. There might be some. Have you found any? They're the best snack. There might be some hiding by my old cave. Is it her? Is she the one who wants it? Snack. 
Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How about a potato chip foot? Can't say I miss that cave, but I do miss these. Thanks, Bestie. All right, what's going on? Hey there, Bestie. We've got a new target. Cromdo's back in town. I know that greedy crumbag has some juicy dirt. I'm not talking about his pathetic little lies or scams either. I'm sure you'll find something good. Don't let me down, bestie. How do you stand on that foot? We're, we need to find out what Cromdo does at midnight. I'll deal with that later. I want to get to the new area and see what the, Oh, bro, thanks for helping me with the training and the stump and stuff. Sorry it was a waste of time. It was never a waste of time, Chandlo. We murdered a mother and all of her children, and you ate them, and that... Sometimes that's all that matters. You're a lot stronger than me, in like a metaphorical way. They don't give out trophies for inner strength though, so I made you one, Chandlo. No. <laughs> Thanks for calming the crowd, buddy. The others might fight a lot, but I know that we'll all come through together. Things get tough. Whatever monster's out there, it's no match for our teamwork. Fucking squeeb. All right, hang on. So, no. Uh... I like the red cedar best. And this is the indoors. Hey! It looks awful. Great. Alright, so, uh, we are gonna go... Okay. We're gonna go find Floofty. And for some reason, that didn't, uh... There we go. Oh, I see. That's that's the three things that I need to stick in there. All right, fine. All right, Snorpy's up here. I want to see what he ha wants me to do. Oh my god, of course. Barbells of absurd weight which Chandler uses to maintain his arm size. And that's the conspiracy port. All right. Hey, wake up, wake up, wake up. How you doing, buddy? Uh, I'm gonna feed you. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Just gonna feed you a few more children. There you are. And uh, how's it going, Snorpy? Ah, chum. Good to see you on this ordinary tyranny-free day. Let us talk pleasantly of the weathers. I love you so much. You are amazing. Yes, the weathers. Wink! I've discovered something terrible. My seismic readings show that activity in the mountain is growing stronger and more frequent over time. We must find the source of the quakes before the situation grows out of control. There is an unusually large bug snack on the mountain that I'm certain is involved. The formidable Scoopy Banoopy. Mm. Disassemble it and dispose of the components in my mouth, and once more <laughs> we will have thwarted the Grumpanati. Uh, you know what? Absolutely. Uh, sure. Oh. I will I will defeat it and stick it into your mouth. Fuck's sake. Uh, okay. Um, splitting up, doing the deal, flying to the moon. What are we doing? Uh, we are going after Fine Floofy. Which I think is going to be this way. In the scorched gurge. That's a white sheep poof. I recall. Okay. I knew that someone wanted me to do that. I don't know why. Alright. Oh! Hey, Chandlo. What are you doing out here? Hey, bro. 
Just got done fixing up the old bridge. You're such a good person. Would have done it sooner, but Cromdo wanted me to pay him for the rights of repair. <laughs> Whatever that means. <laughs> oh, God. Anyway, no need to thank me. Just go find Shelda, all right? Okay. I guess this is not towards the Boiling Bay. It's called, this is it's called, it's called. Sizzling Sands. Okay, so we are going to find Shelda. Mothsa Supreme, that is what knocked down my airship. Wow. It's a giant pizza. What else is out here? Breakfasty bits? What are you? Oh! It's a praying picantus. And... Buffalocust. There we go. So that's something that, uh, that that's what Cromdo wants me to feed. It's a loaded spuddy. Oh, it's a sody D. Oh. So that thing dive bombs into its favorite sauces. So. Whoa! Are they fighting? They're fighting! Oh! Put that out with sauce. Nope. I guess I need to lure it into the water. Okay. Something's going to happen. I should probably not be so close to you. It turned into other things. Okay, this is real weird. Uh, alright. Whoa, what the fuck is this? I got an egg. I don't know what to do with that egg. Uh, so it likes hot sauce. You gonna dive bomb my sauce? None of that worked! Oh my god! And I am on fire. Whoa! Okay, so I, I let the egg thing catch on fire. I let the egg catch on fire, and then it hatched into an eggler, because everything here is alive and can talk. It's really interesting. Um. This looks like something. Breakable ground. Should find a way to smash it. Yeah, I see her over there. I'll get to her in a second. Okay.
There is some kind of bug snack on bug snack violence happening over there, and I am going to profit from it. Gimme a flap a jack a rack. Flap jack a rack. Flap jack a rack. I see. All right, all right. Let's go find Shelda and figure out what the fuck. Oh. Mm, this one has many questions. So it is my wisdom shall be shared. Okay. It's a cockroach. Hold on. Uh, I'll, I'll talk to you in a second. Yeah, she's pretty frightening. I I'll talk to her in just a second. Can I just sneak up on you? No? Okay. Can I just put the snack up? Got myself a taco. Talk roach. Uh, okay. Hi there, hippie. What the fuck? Um, will you come to Snacksburg? In seeking inner peace, Shelda has renounced material temptation. Oh, good. So it is that Shelda is really grumping hungry. I see. Seek the yellow sauce within the great maw of stone. On this, I shall be sustained. <laughs> Get cheese sauce for Shelda. I need cheese sauce. Whoa. Cut open. Ooh, that's a pizza slicer. Or at least the thing on top of it that's showing a pizza slicer. Okay, I wonder how I get in. Oh, hey, that's a Grumpus. That is a Grumpus. I see. Listen, they're all Grumpuses. Okay, there's cheese. Grumpus. Wow, okay. So I need to get up there to get that, uh, that their cheese sauce. What is that? Uh, score pepper. Lurks invisibly in the desert and roasts anything that gets too close. Alright. <gasps> you little fucker! Oh my god. Alright, in Chirito. Oh! Where? Ah! Fuck's sake. Alright, I'm on fire again. Alright. So. We need to find some way of getting up in there. I need to get that there cheese sauce. Can I just pull you down? Can I pull you down? Nope, that doesn't do too much. Let's see. Are you gonna shoot fire at me? Whoa! Well, I'm on fire again. Alright, so how the fuck do I get up there? Let's see. Okay, nope, too high to jump. Inchirito is no longer fucking with me, so... Let's see if this works. It does not. Too heavy. So let's try go for something... A bit more attainable? Nope, that doesn't work either. Alright. Oh! Or I can just use my fucking grappling hook. That'll also work. I want him to catch that egg on fire. Come on. 
I really don't know. What, what do I do about guys who are on fire? Can I put them out with cheese? Oh, hey, it worked. Okay, so I can actually put them out. Alright, so I can put them out. That's something. Here is your material sustenance. Ooh. Ooh. The yum is one. And one is craving reapers. Alright, you're the worst Consider so far. Consider the sandscape a reflection of the mind. One unable to escape its dry embrace. First, an act of rebirth. To break out of my current shelter. So too must you break shells, crack open the egglers, give them new life. And then feed them to you? I broke eggs and made an omelette. I too have burst from my shell, and so oozes forth my spiritual yoke. Oh my Yet God. obstacles devour that yoke, the sinister peccantis of temptation. To truly destroy these obstacles, one must break them down into their elements. I've already done that too. Oh, I have to break down another one. Alright then. Let's see. Oh, well, there's one over here. Hey there, buddy! I need you to come chase me. Are you... Come on, buddy. You gonna fucking chase me? Oh, you little shit. Alright, hold on. Let's see if I can... Put you out. What do you hate? What do you hate? He... Alright, he loves cheese sauce, I suppose. Okay, that makes sense. He loves cheese sauce. And he also loves... He's gonna come down? He's not gonna come down. What the fuck? Oh, or I'll just grab another one. That's fine. Hey, buddy. Come here. Come on, let's go swimming. Let's go. Come on, buddy. Explode! Yeah! Sandstorm, huh? I have unblocked the obstacle. Snack of temptation removed. <laughs> Yet, one still lost in darkness, seeking the light. Shelda. For only in the light of Mother Nature can the toxin be purged. <gasps> Seek a rasby deep below. A hidden ruin, a maze of trials. Guide this Rasby to one's side. You are standing on top of my last nerve. Uh, all right. The path. So I need to guide a black Rasby from the under ruins to Shelda. Now, it seems pretty clear that to do that, we're going to... Uh... Oh, you know what? Don't see how we're getting in there. When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's a trip to the hospital. Thanks, Crondo. All right, so... 
This is what we need to do. I need to find some way of breaking this. Where is fucking Chadlow when you need him? Come on, buddy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right here. Come on. No, I need something that dive bombs. Do you dive bomb? What do you do? Uh, yep, yeah, dive bombs its favorite sauces. All right, so let's give him some favorite sauces. That's, uh, oh, ranch dressing. That's gotta be it. My biggest concern is I'm almost out of space. Go get him, buddy. Actually, put you out. Can I put you out with cheese? Can I put you out with ketchup? Can do. Yep. Let's just run around here on fire for a few moments. Sorry. All right. Oh, there's more corpses. Okay. Okay. I see. Okay. Okay. I see. Interesting. All right, so I've got some way of... All right. Okay. So I've unlocked a different way of getting in and out of this place. Cool. Uh... This is definitely where I'm going to... Right, so I'm, I'm clearly going to be... Uh, um, I see. And those guys are going to make things as difficult as possible. And there's the Black Strabby. Okay, so it's going to be the same shit that we did before. Look, get the fuck out of my way. We're just going to have to uh, get a Black Rasby through a uh, obstacle course. And then go down and get him. And then get the fuck out. Okay, we can do this. I do gotta say, Shelda is just stand like she's just draining all of my will to exist. Loves chocolate. Okay. Let's give you some chocolate. Oh no! No! Come back, come back, come back! Okay, I need to do something about those fuckers. Can't take through solid rock, I see. Can I just pretend I did it? Let's see if I can just pretend I did it. Where you at, Shelda? Oh, I see. Look in the light. Well, let's see if I can uh, cheese this a different way. Where the hell is that thing? There.
Oh, did it go all the way back? Mm. Oh, and I have to be careful about that too, huh? All right. All right, well, let's deal with these fuckers. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. How the fuck do I deal with you? It can't go through solid rock. All right, so that's what I have to do. All right, all right, all right. Okay, okay. I can do this. I, I, I don't know why I'm doing all this shit for Shelda. I've just met her, and I really don't like her. Whoa! What the fuck? Oh my. Oh, okay. Ah, fuck sake. Ah. Dude, ah. I am I have to tell you. Ah, uh, all right. Hold on. I just got to be smart about this, clearly. Next, we'll find out if that's possible. you a rasby from the darkness oh what once was lost now is found the path to light determined the time has come egress from the sandscape so it is that shelter survives you are my least favorite so far that is including wiggle and wiggle is a monster i don't understand why i did any of that it was a metaphor. <laughs> now to Snacksburg goes me to bring such clarity to my followers. Oh Christ, she thinks she's a cult leader. Eh, my grumpy butt is so sore. Oh, note to self, get a chair. Spuddy. All right. Alright, so there's a couple things that I didn't get. I did not get a, uh, uh, I didn't get a, uh, uh, what's its fuck? Uh, uh, the, the, the fucking buffalo flaming wings thing, because I don't know how the hell to deal with things that are on fire. There's a bunch of stuff that I'm gonna need to go back to get. Um, apparently, there, I, uh, something about slicing up a pizza. Oh, hello, Bunger. I love you too, buddy, but I gotta get back to town. See if I can interview... Uh, I don't... I've already forgotten her name. I hate her. Alright, so there's Philbo. There's... Oh, what are you doing in here? Hey there, how's it going? It's going great. Uh... What... 
No. Ta -ta! Ta -ta! What did she want again? What did you want? Feed me that red. Oh, right. That's right. That's right. Okay. Well, um, sure. She hmm. You get teeth. Mm. Oh. Here it comes. The ballad of a generation. Bug snacks. Bugs snacks on the island in my mouth. So tasty. Well, that's all I have so far. It's a work in progress, but what do you think? Just hire, just hire a, a lyric writer. Hire a songwriter. What is the matter with you? Apart from everything that is clearly the matter with you. That was great. Don't patronize me, darling. The truth is written all over your face. In I don't Sharpie. know why I bother. I know I don't have any real talent. Yes. My whole career was an accident. Yes. <sighs> Sorry, darling. I need to be alone for a while. The rest of your life. Fuck off. <sighs> Nothing like a campfire. Having trouble with your pets there? Oh, God. Shut it, Wambus. My little ones are just excited to see me. That's so. Bet it's easy to keep them in line when they're half your size. What are you saying? You really love bug snacks so bad? Go big or go home. You! Oh, go on back to your cactus, you old coot! I see. So, now, you want me to go after a big, big monster also, don't you? What's going on? I hate to say it, but Wambus has a point. Okay. Bigger snacks means more to love. And they might be a bit smarter. Might respond better to my training, too. Honey. Please get me the biggest, snackiest bug snacks you can find. Please? Uh, I need to donate a praying, pray, a praying picantus and a Scoopy Banoopy. I see. But I also need to give a Scoopy Banoopy to, uh, to, to, to Snorpy. It's, uh, 18? 18 to upgrade. Alright, so let's get rid of the sodies. Let's... Hinkle. It's 3 out of 18. Alright, so, who's hungry? Ah, come here, my little... Nothing like a campfire. Fucking horrible monsters. Who needs more shit? You need more shit. What's up, Befica? Let's eat! Uh, I'm gonna uh, give you probably a bacon nose. Oh, yeah. Yep, that's what I thought. And how about a uh, fucking taco head? Oh my god, this is awful. Um, how about your eggs? There you go. Yeah, delightful. There. Okay. You look horrible. And I, I, ah, but nothing like getting toasty. Yep. Here you go. Have some. Uh, yep. 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 Yeah. Oh my god. Is that a? What did I do? Here's to a hard day's work. It's it's a cheesy Ritz cracker. Okay. Eggler. I'm gonna put an Eggler. Um. Woo. Sure. Nothing like a campfire. Nothing like a campfire. Oh, that's where Shelda is. All right. So I believe that one of the things that I needed to do was an in Chirito. What else needs to be here? Nope. And nope. I'll have to look it up. All right, I'm gonna see if I can find Shelda and see if she is ready to be uh, interviewed. Oh, Shelda's back. Wiggle and Gramble are gonna be so stoked. Ah, oh, yes, one has returned from a great spiritual sojourn. So it is. One would really like to lie down. Is she hitting on him? Sounds intense. I bet you're overflowing with wisdom now. Go ahead and lay it on me, shell dog. Ah, uh, yes, uh, wisdom. Ah, uh, she's a phony um, too. Okay. The strength you seek cannot be found within toxins, for the truest strength is the will to resist. Whoa, I get it. I gotta check my snacks, and if they look toxic, I won't eat them. No, one is not. You... Ah, oh, 
Clearly you need more guidance. He doesn't. Oh, He's yeah, perfect I the do. way he is. I'll bring the others, too. Oh, God. No one is sure it will be enlightening. Hey, Shelda, I'm going to interview you, and then I'm going to try to avoid talking to you for the rest of forever. You have time for an interview? When one asks questions, one may receive answers. I hate you so much. She's got uh, googly eyes. Those are those are googly eyes on her necklace. The, those are the bug snacks googly eyes. Start the interview. Who are you? One is called Shelda. A one who is me acts as a vessel for the will of Mother Nature. So it is. One maintains balance and purity. Okay. Why come to Snacktooth Island? <gasps> a calling felt in the soul. <laughs> Distant voice saying, they need you. Three tickets won in a raffle. <laughs> Lizbert held a raffle? Uh, a raffle is a metaphor. Uh, but yes. Thoughts on bug snacks? The toxin. The mother abhors them in all their alluring forms. One feels them crawling around us, beneath us, inside us. Okay. Who is the mother anyway? Mother Nature! The mother! She, the purest delight from whom all life flows. Okay. Why did you leave town? One cast out they, the scion of toxins. Yet, lessons unlearned, the cravings only grew. So it was one journeyed far to isolate oneself and live by example. No one's impressed by so the way you're fucking... So it was. Mm. One got very, very lost. <laughs> Any info on Lisbert? She, the huntress, is gone from us. Strayed from the mother's path, chasing the healer's tainted love. Thrice were they warned, so this once you shall be warned. A doom befalls those who consume the toxin. I think she's got something there, though. I do think that she's got something there. She's referring, she's, when she says toxin, she's clearly talking about bug snacks. Doom, can you be more specific? A doom of toxin unending. The ground shakes. The sky splits. Look not upon it, move not an inch, or be swallowed by the Queen of Venom. Or so I heard. I see. Thanks, that was all very... Oh, hold on. You're a fraud, aren't you? Everyone is a fraud in a sense. But you in more of a sense. In a specific sense, you are actually a fraud. Thanks, that was all very unhelpful. Ever are more questions asked, seldom are more answers given. One must live content with the absence of knowing. Meditate on this. Nah. A vessel oh. of the unknown. May answers be found in its mystery. Okay. You, you've given me, you've given me a, a box without a key. How delightful. Uh. Okay. Uh. All right, well. Okay, this is, this is fucking adorable. All right, I'm gonna, um, I, I'm, I'm, I don't know. Hey, how's it going? I'm going to, I don't know. Hey, Triffany, I'm gonna f see if I can feed you. Snack bug. Neat. Oh my God, you're a pretzel. What have I done to you? I've turned you into a pretzel. Okay. Well, okay. 
Okay. Aloha. Uh, hello. Spag. All right, so you know what? Now you got a potato for a nose. Have fun with that. All right. Uh, do I have? I do have letters? Okay. In returning from the wastes, one overflows with gratitude to you who finds the lost. May this herbaceous token bring you peace of mind, clarity, and a better overall smell. Sheldon, I got a hanging planter. Ooh. And uh, oh wow! Once there's ketchup on them, those weenie worms are anything but shy. Just glad I saw that from a safe distance. Oh, it did chase me out of this little thingy. Thanks for the help, and I got a drafting table. All right. Well, I'll be, stranger. You got every kind of sauce that grows. Thanks to you, I've got plenty of harvesting to do. You just drop by the farm whenever you want to talk sauce. Sauce plant seedlings, and also a sauce rug, which is a regular rug that just has sauce on it. Mm. One has seen a vision of toxin to be purged. Red as rubies, a deviously adorable fruit skittering across the sand. Offer this fiend to the box of purity! I got a purge. Purge? A raspy? Purge? What the fuck do you mean by purge? Okay. That's weird. That's real weird. That's that's real weird. Okay. Um. Okay, so. Uh. Your neighbor, huh? Alright, uh. Here's my strong trophy from Chandlo. Oh. He's. he's. he's too good. for all of us. Huh. Yeah, but uh, that would be putting up a gift that you gave me, and you can go fuck yourself. Alright, that's gonna be about it for tonight. We've opened up a lot more questions. We have gotten pretty much zero new answers. We've got, uh, let's see, so something came to town, carved the words no more bug snacks up onto a sign on the wall, and uh, then turned into a bunch of bug snacks and scattered. And it's very, very similar to something that we saw up in the, uh, the where we met Shedlow and, and Snorpy. Walked up, uh, I, it is, there was something standing in the trees, and then it just sort of went away. And it was real fucking freaky. Okay, um, that's us. Uh, more next time, when we will try to find... What the hell is her name? We're going to try to find next... We are going after... Floofty, who we have been told is uh, possibly eating people. So, that sounds like fun. Meantime, everybody, thanks very much for coming along. I love you all, and... Uh, be good. Be safe. Good night, everybody.